Alright, hey guys, Loose for Gaming here. It's time to continue the Yoshi's Island walkthrough. This is, this is, uh, part number, uh, 13. Alright, now, now we're here in Goonie Rides, and before I really get any further, before I forget, that much is a good Slipknot song. I wanted to give a verbal shout out to, um, to, uh, to a guy that, that, actually lives in the same state that I do. That 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 um uh, that, that I talked to all through um Google Plus. And his username is Kenzen2002. And as you figured it can it and yes, that is the that is the Japanese name for destructo disc with the with the number two thousand two. Oh son of a oh Son of a... But, yeah, uh... Though not very many people use Google Plus anymore, I have been there pretty much ever since it started. I've been there for, like, six years. Or longer. But, yeah, it wasn't long after it started that I, um... After they, oh. Uh, Brought it, brought it online. That um, that they um, that I've been there. Oh shoot! And be right back. All right, now we're continuing. Now, speaking of Slipknot. I don't remember which song it was. I think it was before I forget. But one of their songs is talking about a tr transvestite. I am not making this up. The video to the song is where it, is where it makes the song out like it's talking about a transvestite. Though... If I had the choice between Slipknot and Stone Sour, I would, I actually would prefer Stone Sour. Given the choice between the two. Cause my, the first song that I've ever heard by that, with, with Corey Ta Taylor singing on it, is, is, um, Gone Sovereign and Slash Absolute Zero. Why do I feel unconfident about this part? Oh, son of a... Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, jeez. Good thing that was there. Uh. But, I mean, Slipknot is, is pretty good, though. That's actually where Corey Taylor got his start. But Corey Taylor is in both Slipknot and Stone Sour. Can't remember which one of my email accounts it is, but I know one of them actually does have a Stone have a pic has a picture of the band, uh, of Stone Sour. Uh, as the back, as like the um, background image, but I don't think it's one I use regularly anymore. 
because I got I got like all four of them tied into each other so it gives me more space in my email so it gives me more email space and before y'all ask I don't even remember how I did it so yeah but yeah it was but yeah I I I I did that a long time ago. Last time I did it was when I created the fourth one and and I've had that fourth one for like the last sheesh, I'd say like the last five years. And so yeah, that all four of them are tied into each other. Which gives me more email space. It, like if the, uh, like if, like for example, like if the one that I use, that I use mainly, gets full, the, uh, and, and someone sends me an email, instead of them getting a demon mailer, they would, which is what they call for when you get a, uh, for when you get a, uh, like a, uh, return email where, or like if somebody's email box is full, that's what they call them as a demon mailer. Gee, or as I like to call it, a Gene Simmons mailer. <laughs> is it possible to like a certain artist too much? <laughs> so, I mean, seriously, I have listened to so many Ozzy concerts that I practically can quote what he would say. From, 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 with, uh, was depending upon what, the, when the concert was done, I could practically tell, tell you what he would say. That's like, that's like an, um, that's like back in the 80s, that was, that whenever he would st fix, he, be close to doing Paranoid, he would always say, Okay, what do you want to hear? What do you want to hear? What do you guys upstairs want to hear? And back then, I don't know if it's like this today, but back then, when you were up in the upstairs area of, of the um, concert halls, more than like, that's where the majority of your drug addicts would be in a concert. And yes, that, it, he... Ozzy never got sober until after Randy Rhodes got died in the, in the helicopter accident. Oh jeez! Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll be right back. All right. Now, at the time of the um timestamp, uh, where the where the commentary would be, I have 13 red coins. And so, yeah, here are the others, which... Oh, shoot! Okay, y'all seen it. Be right back. Again. Alright. Now... We have 16, or I have 16 at the time of this time, at the time of the, uh, where the commentary is. What's up, what's in here? All right. Okay. Wait, what's down here? Ah, uh, probably nothing. Cool, it was raining money! <laughs> now, if it did it in real life, my... My, um, my, my remark to that would be, yeah, and monkeys might fly out of our butts. But I'll surrender and go Amish. No!
right, how many would that make? 18, okay. Okay, I think there are red coins in the, uh, in the mix here. So... Oh, shoot! Oh, jeez! Be right back! Alright, I have words for this. But I'm not gonna say them. Dang it! One, one more time. All right. Okay, here I go again. Which I think is. Oh wait. No, that's Van Halen. That's who I'm thinking of. Why do I get um Van Halen when they were when they were with Sammy Hagar mixed up with White Snake? I mean that's two totally different bands. Okay, screw you, leg. Where the? I was like, where in the crap are you taking my legal ward? Law <laughs> joke. Okay, where is that other flower? Okay, I know y'all, I know y'all have seen the first, uh, the, the four that I have gotten. So... Uh... I know y'all have seen the one down there. Don't tell me that was another. F uh, it was probably in that. Yeah, it was probably in this helicopter part. Dang! Well, instead of taking up time, just a second, just a second, folks, the computer decided to screw up on me. Alright, now it's time to show you where that last flower is. And there it is. It's right up there at the top of the flying parts. So, be right back one more time. Alright, and to explain the life count, those real, those real lent bonus challenges are gonna be the death of me yet. Oh shoot, I just wasted a... I just wasted a card! Hopefully I'll be, it'll be a card one. So, yeah. Five up. Oh, jeez. Be right back. Alright. Now we're to welcome to Cloud World 5 6. And, yep. This first section is. Dang it. Dang it. Screw it. Dang 
did it. And people think I go crazy with the enemies. Especially the lack of tubes. Yeah, I found a cool trick in, um, in Super Mario Bros. X, where if you, uh, I, I don't know if it does this on version 2, on, on version 2 or not, but where I know on, um, on the, uh, version that I use to make these games, to make them games that I do, I know on the version that I use to do them, that, uh, that there's a cool trick where, where if you do the, um, Super Mario Brothers 3 style, styled lack of two, you can have it be, and, and then if you click on lack of two, you can, t you can tell it to, where it can be like a lack of two spawn another lack of twos. And that gets crazy. That oh, will be, well, yeah, be right back. Yep. I don't see any way how I'm going to be able to get the kid now. But... Come here, little turd! Thank you! <laughs> oh god, that was a little inappropriate! <laughs> I think I just missed a red coin, but I don't give a crap. Oh crap! <laughs> I don't give a crap then, oh crap! <laughs> okay, I'm starting a little earlier than, in the level then. Uh, oh crap! Okay. Well, that accident happened to work out. Unlike the last one. But thanks for giving me that red coin. Baseball enemy. I mean, I forgot that could happen. Even if, uh, even when, uh, um, if, 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 uh, um, if one, if that, um, that, um, that one that throws the eggs. But like catcher, if they if they throw a um, throw a, um throw an egg, I forgot that they can oh um, that if they hit a red coin, it still counts as an item. Or, or if they hit coins, it still counts as you collect them. That is so cool. Stupid green turd! <sighs> and no, I am not gonna get those. Even though they can make things easier, it's really hard to control your aim with them. Though I do use them in casual play, but since this is a, a walkthrough, I, whoa, cool! I hit an enemy from behind, and it rolls off in the opposite direction it was face, it was headed. <laughs> that was that was really weird. Flowers already. Jeez. I did not expect that.
what pipe is it? Okay. I mean, I knew there was one you could go down. Though, what it did, I do not remember. Uh... Okay... Oh, they, hey, there it is. I actually don't think I remember ever... Oh, wow! Damn, get in there! Alright, whoa! Alright, how many... 15. Yeah, I'm not so much, I'm not so, I'm not as much worried about stars as I am the other items. Cause, cause, like, I tend to, I, I tend to keep a lot of, uh, point, a lot of star cards, so, yeah, that's why I'm not, I'm not as worried about the, um, uh, about the um, stars as I am the red coins and the flowers. this puts me in I'll decide from there if I'm gonna all right be right back all right get before it before it that was close okay I got a red coin y'all probably didn't see it but y'all heard the sound effect Oh, crap. Yeah, you can jump on the eggs that are thrown by that enemy. And then, and then you can, um... And then you can collect them. Like I said, I... Okay. And now... Okay, all I got are 20 points, so... Eh. I got card bonus challenges available anyway. That I can do at any time. And that, and there's also, um, and there's also the, um, the bonus challenge. I mean, the boat, the bandit battle codes, or code. Because I can just go into, um, the balloon pop one and, um, and, um, you know what? That sounds like a good idea. Be right back. Okay, I'm back, and now we're at shifting platforms ahead. Uh, what I don't understand about this level is that is that it puts you facing facing right, but you have to start going left. I think on World One Five they they start you pointing to the right. I mean to the left. Though it may be the right, I really don't know. Or I don't remember. That was like that was like eleven. That was like twelve. That was like 11 parts ago. I'm oh, sorry, I forgot what number, what no, what part number we were on. But 
but yeah, this level tends to get a little crazy with the, um, with the, with the, um, uh, dotted line platforms. to time that. Because I have had that happen to me before a lot. Especially on the Super Nintendo. Back when I was playing this when I was like, when I was like five. I think I was like five. I was like five or six when I beat this game the first time. Maybe seven. Probably more like six or seven. What? I have I, I have known about Super Mario Kart since I was five. Mama. That was when I got the Game Boy Advance. Wait a minute. Why do I get the feeling there are red coins there? <sighs> okay, I guess they are. Okay, then. I wasn't really going to worry about the, um, the, um, the, um, dotted coin block, uh, the dotted line coin. Because I really don't think that there are any red coins under there. I mean, ROM hacks, maybe. Because I have seen some ROM hacks that, um, that have had red coins in the dotted lines. Oh, jeez. Well. Yeah, sure, why not? Because then I get to check and see if there were any, um, red coins in the, um, in this pipe. Oh, okay. Flower? Well, that's something. Okay, I don't think so. Okay. Well, that was just wasted time. Now, 
why I've been pretty much doing these once a week is because, like I said, I've been, I've been working with that, uh, level, it put that level maker on SMBX, and, oh crap, and so, yeah, uh, yeah, so, yeah, that's why it seems like I've only been doing them, like, once a week. Maybe twice, depending upon how I feel. And, yeah, I am going to finish the Legend of 39. Like I've said before, this this one that I'm doing right now is mainly just practice for the, uh, for the level maker. I think I just missed a... I think I just missed a red coin. No. Oh, son of a... Yeah, if you're lucky, you can push those, uh, tap taps off and make them fall into that hole. Oh, shoot. What's it? Stars, those are kind of helpful. Yeah, off footage, I got, I got like, I think I got, I think it was like five extra, um, star cards. So, yeah. Did I just one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five? Yeah, it was five, and I think I just screwed up. So be right back. All right, now I got it. And some, for some reason, I feel like I should have more than nine red coins by now. Though I could be wrong. I have been wrong about that stuff before. Yep, this is where it gets kind of tricky. Oh dear God, help me! Point of no return. <laughs> oh, dear God. Well, be right back again. Oh, wait. I forgot there's a middle ring at this part. So, yeah, just so that I don't screw up the video, Oh, please, God, wake me. 
Man, I love that song. And those of you that are Metallica fans, y'all would know that song well. Of the majority of y'all. Okay. Because, yeah. One is like their most popular song. Okay. Okay, folks, I think I'm going to be able to get in one last level. Because I know this next level, I, I have done it for a lot. And the um, boss fight is a little different than what we have had so far. Ah, oh, great slot machine. Y'all don't need to see me screw up on this one. Be right back. Alright, now we got bonus challenge 5 opened up. Well, I know it's not the slots, because slots are for, are for World 6. I think it's for this world that it's the roulette. But yeah, we're at Raphael the Raven's Castle. Why do I, does this level always make me think of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Oh wait, I think I... Nope. Yep, you can, those kinds of platforms can help you jump real high. Just be careful. Just be careful, because sometimes they can throw you into spikes. Or I know that, or I've heard that they can on, um, on, um, on the, on, um, the Ultimate Castle Challenge or something like that. Whatever the extra level is for World 6. It's like a castle masterpiece or something like that. I really don't remember. I've never unlocked it, so... I just know it from the uh, player's guide. For the um, Super Nintendo version. But yeah, I know for a fact that... All right. Now, now that kind of bullet bill can ricochet off walls. I think it's called a bouncing bill. I really don't remember. All right. Okay. Okay, that didn't work. Okay. Like I said, on this level, I know for sure I know where... I do know where everything is at. Dang it! Like I said before, the, um, don't worry about the stars if you, if you have a, um, like a 10 or, like a, uh, like two 10s or 20 point to, before the boss, cause that, oh, cause the stars really don't matter until you're right there at the boss door. Then you can use one of those cards and, um, and, and, well, as long as you do not take damage off the boss. Because that's where it can be tricky for this game, is the boss levels. What the... Uh, okay. Uh, 
Yeah, let's do fire. Shots with the um, super red watermelon. Now you know. Now you know I wasn't just screwing around with you. Okay, just a second. Dang, I was cutting it close for that one file. sure if I was going to make that or not. I, mean, I kind of thought I would, but yeah. That was all the items for that part. All it was was just a flower and those two red coins. Okay, how in the world? Oh. Yeah, I forgot about that door. Oh great, another train section. Well, yippee ki -yay. stars by now, I kind of recommend you use a card. If, unless you have 20, or if you have not got 20, then I suggest you use a 10 point card. Ah, oh, son of a... Please let there be a, um... Uh, 
Alright, now, like I said, the boss fight for this one is a little weird. I will show you all three hits for this one. Because it's, cause, I mean, it's different between hits. It's the same, it's the same style that you would have to use to damage it, but it's diff, it's the aiming is different. You get, uh, well, uh, never enter the Koopa Kingdom. I will banish you forever, twinkle in the, twinkle in the heavens, be gone. Sorry, I for, I forgot about, I forgot how to do my, my Kamek voice uh, for a moment. <laughs> And, yeah, you do not get to keep your eggs. I forgot to mention that. That's the only thing I do not like about this boss battle. If you do not get to keep carry your eggs over to the next level. Okay, how you do this is that you take the posts, pound, and, yeah, hit them where a guy never wants to get hit. Well, alright, okay, just a second, folks, yeah, okay, now, as you hit him, the aim gets, like I said, gets different every time, so for that final hit, you have got to be quick. And there we go! Alright, and I'm gonna tell you right now, the bone, the extra stage in this level is called, I mean in this world, is called Kamek's Revenge. But, that's all for now. So, yeah. Live long and prosper, and that's it. Bye. Oh, and ne in next video, we will be starting World 6. Which I know where everything is at. Now, live long and prosper, and, uh, and, and stay tuned for the next part. And blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah, I forgot one thing. Showing off what happens when you... After, showing you off the animation after this uh, castle gets destroyed. Yeah. And three, two, one. Now. Oh, look, Yoshi's Island's gone to hell in a handbasket. Sounds like Riverdale. Oh well, live long. Yeah, y'all know. I don't. I've done said it twice. So, yeah.